the twenty-first letter of the Thai alphabet. Ta tao. Ta tao. Ta is the first part, which is the sound it makes as an initial consonant or starting sound. Ta has the first tone. It has the same sound and same tone with ta pa ta. The fifteenth letter of the Thai alphabet we already learned. It has an equivalent sound in English, which is the English T when you pronounce the word star. Or if you speak Mandarin Chinese, it is the same as the in the word ta. For any of you who has trouble pronouncing ta ta. Please go back and watch Thai Alphabet episode fifteen on Ta Pa Ta, because I already explained it in detail. So go check it out. Okay, as for the word Tao itself, it is the second part, which is the vocabulary or word associated with the letter. The word Tao is a generic term for turtle or tortoise. If by any chance you would like to be specific about which kind of turtle or tortoise you're talking about, in Thai you basically add an adjective behind the word "tao" to make it more specific. For example, "tao bok," "tao bok." The word "bok" means dry land or land. And if you add it behind the word "tao," it becomes "tao bo," which means a tortoise. Another example would be the word "tao nam," "tao nam," or sometimes "tao nam jud," "tao nam jud." The word "nam" means water. The word "dude" means fresh or unsalted. A combination of "nam" and "dude." "Nam dude" means fresh water, so "tao nam dude" means freshwater turtle, which is a kind of turtle that lives in freshwater sources such as rivers, lakes, canals, etc. Another example is. ตาทะเลตาทะเล The word ทะเล means sea. So when you combine it with the word ตา it becomes ตาทะเล which basically means sea turtle. So now you know how to say three different types of turtles: ตาบกตาน้ำ and ตาทะเล But if you don't want to be specific, you just want to talk about turtle or tortoise in general. You can just say the word "tao," like in this twenty-first letter of the alphabet, "ta tao." Let's try to pronounce "ta tao" together. Ta tao. Ta tao. Ta, tau. All right. So now it's time to write ta tau together. First off, when you look at the letter ta tau, it looks very similar to da dek, which is the previous letter we just learned. The only difference between the two is the notch. As you can see. Da dek doesn't have any notch at the top. It has a very smooth curve, from left to right. On the other hand, ta tao has a notch at the top, and that's the difference between the two. So, why don't we start writing ta tao together? It's not so hard. You start from the circle, go clockwise, go down to the left, go up, make a notch, and then go down. All right. Let's try that again. So you start from the circle, go.
go clockwise, go down a bit to the left, go up, make a notch, and then go down. And that is how to write Tao Tao in Thai. And that's it for Tao Tao. Next, we have Tao Thung.